Hi everyone, it's Mitch. Uh, it's December 22nd. Um, just finished up our first weekend of bowls. It's freezing here in Chicago. It's one degree above zero. Uh, it's going to make it probably around negative 30 with the wind chill. So those of you uh, watching the Bears game tonight, you might want to take that into consideration that, uh, you know, it's supposed to snow and all that other good stuff as well. But, uh, you know, that, that negative 30 is uh, something that you might want to be game planning in. Any event, finished off our first weekend of the bowls. Four and one. Um, it's eighty percent clip. If we can keep that clip going, uh, you know, we'll we'll be more than happy with it. Um, could have easily been five and zero. Oh, a couple different decisions by the Troy coaching staff, by a couple of Troy players, and uh, you know we're we're off to the races. Didn't work out for us. Wasn't feeling so comfortable about that game to begin with. I was in the forum, uh, you know, the hours leading up to the game, and I was saying, you know what, I, I'm really not feeling this one. And uh, you know, there's reason. I, I'm a contrarian. Um, there's a reason I'm a contrarian. I'll get into that in a second. And, uh, you know, when I see the public so adamant about certain picks, it really makes me want to go the other way, turn turn, turn around and run. Um, not a nice thing to say, but, you know, we're, we're here to talk all about the same stuff, is that most of the general public, um, they don't do too well at this stuff. They're not too good at picking games. They just look at the sheet and they circle games. That's why some of the best um, analysts that I see out on the Internet are guys that really know how to, to, to line up the games position by position, angle on, on angle, and that's how they pick their winners. Not all of us use the same methodology. Uh, not all of, us, all of us have the same record. But most people at least have very good um, reasoning for their picking, and they're not just looking at a game and, and drawing a circle around it and say, wow, Troy you know, should kill Southern Miss or whatever. Now, when I saw that game, I knew that, that Troy was probably in a little bit of trouble, but I thought that they, that they were able to do it. When I started hearing the words Troy and Locke, that's, what, um, that's, when, I, that's when I started to, to look for angles the other way and maybe try and get out and think about doing another video and a quick write-up and uh, you know, hitting the forums and getting out there saying, you know what, I think I'm going to turn around and go the other way. And I seriously considered doing that yesterday. Um, you know, I got into the forum and I, I wrote some posts in there saying, you know, you know, I looked around in the chat room as well, and there was there was no one there because you know there was no college games going on. But um, you know, I stuck with my guns. I made the pick. I had reasoning for making the pick when I made it, and uh, you know I stuck with them. And I think all the reasons that um, you know I I wanted to go against it in the end and why I wasn't feeling it so much pretty much came to fruition, except that you know the DeAndre Brown injury at, at Southern Miss. Um, it maybe could have been a lot worse than 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 you know the overtime loss that Troy took because um, DeAndre Brown we wish you a speedy recovery one of the best players in the game today in any event we got a full slate of games coming up again this week one game Tuesday a great game you know probably gonna be one of the best games on the board at least picking wise um, decent matchup on on Christmas Eve um, you know Friday then Friday we got a game um, Saturday three games Sunday you know Monday. Monday starts the, the where we start having you know days and days and days of, of games and what bowl season is all about and I I'm really looking forward to that. So this is Mitch. Thanks for joining me. I'll see you guys all week in the forum and uh, you know maybe we'll do some chats during some of these games. Have a great day and uh, stay warm out there.